Hey folks! In our last video, we tackled temperature control issues in nylon zipper forming machines. Today, we're diving into part 23 of our troubleshooting series, focusing on small motor problems in these machines. Let's get started. When the small motor doesn't operate, possible causes include a stuck or failed micro switch, wrong or poor circuit connections, a failed relay, a failed start capacitor, a failed take-up switch, a failed 24 volts transformer, or a failed small motor itself. To fix this, Check or replace the micro switch. Check and correct the circuit. Replace the relay. Replace the start capacitor. Replace the take up switch. Replace the 24 volts transformer. Or replace the small motor. If the small motor takes up material slowly, reasons might be overly tight automatic braking or a failed start capacitor. For this, reduce the automatic braking force or replace the start capacitor. When the small motor can't stop and reverses, causes could be a stuck or failed micro switch or worn automatic brakes. To solve this, check or replace the micro switch or replace the automatic brakes. These steps resolve small motor issues. Regular maintenance helps prevent such problems. If this helped, hit follow. Part 24 will tackle warning light, faults in nylon zipper tooth forming machines. Stay tuned.